It's devastating. You know, we got to get up. It's a beautiful Sunday. We're here to represent, you know, Jesus, and we got to walk out into a world that is filled with trash. On Easter morning, streets are lined with piles of trash and dumpsters are overflowing. It's a reality people like Brittany Dawson and her church family hope comes to an end. We ride through here every morning to take me to school. And when you see filth on the street, it just, you know, make the city look so bad. Jacksonians could soon get clarity on the future of the capital city's garbage pickup. The mayor is expected to bring a contract before the council to vote on in a scheduled special meeting Monday afternoon. The last vote failed April 1st. People in Jackson have gone without a garbage collector for nine days. I'm hoping that we can get the country started back up with, you know, the garbage people. Um, so that way we can get the community clean back up. Um, and I think that would be good for us. For now, people in Jackson don't know how much longer they will have to go taking their own trash to a nearby dumpster. Yes, we do have to put the trash in the car and take it to a dumpster. And it's just, it's more devastating for the kids because, you know, this should be a beautiful environment for them. Why do they have to live in an environment where it's trash everywhere? In Jackson, Michaela Franklin, 16, WAPT News.